Empowerment. Empowerment plays a large part in our ability to claim our birth experience. No, 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 no. Our empowerment equals our ability to claim our birth experience. Few of us are empowered when we first conceive. It usually takes the whole of pregnancy to begin to grow those parts of us that need to grow. And only then are we ready for our baby's birth and our own birth as a parent. Since everyone has different strengths and needs, there is no recipe for empowerment. Being empowered means being okay about navigating our path in a situation. This does not mean that we know what to do in every instance, but that we trust we could handle what comes up and know when to call on outside help. All that one does in these 40 weeks builds the type of empowerment that it takes to birth and raise a baby. The farm, a community in Tennessee, experienced this years ago. They offered to raise any baby not wanted by a pregnant woman. It was soon discovered, however, that all the young mothers who had decided to give up their babies for adoption decided to keep them when they were educated and received help to become empowered. Empowerment takes a force of intention that paves your way through, through an experience. It pulls you to your desired destination. Your wise self further supports your path because you are clear in your desire. There is less work and less worry about a result if you work to empower yourself along the way. When you reach a place of empowerment, there is a depth of strength and calmness that you feel. This radiates out to all who are near. This is Sunny, reading from Sacred Birthing, Birthing a New Humanity.